Ladies and gentlemen, we move to our next matchup. It is in the men's heavyweight division, and Armenia will face Ukraine on the left arm here at East versus West. Ladies and gentlemen, firstly, welcome this man to the table. He hails from and is representing Armenia. Welcome, David Donikian. David Dadikian representing Armenia. This is an absolute powerhouse, considered one of the top guys on the planet with left arm today. He has a tough challenge, but he believes it's going to be a very easy day. And he also will pull two matches. So for him, this is important to go through this easy. And his opponent, ladies and gents, is a multiple Ukrainian national, EAF European and WAF World Champion. Please welcome him now, making his way to the table, Yevgeny Prun! Nick, how can this be an easy match for David? This is Evgeny Prudnik from Ukraine. Prudnik is impressive. What a he powerhouse. Has, he has a lot of different styles. He said he's coming in a Terminator shape. That's his words. So strong on a hook so strong at catching i mean i know david's fast i know it's david's good arm but this man he's facing <laughs> this is going to be a, this is going to be a challenge for david let's see where this match goes we're going to go to round number one again for the coin flip to see who wants which side of the table <laughs> Oh. Did Evgeny win the? Did he win the toss? Does he want to go on the good side? No, David won the toss. He's okay. going to take. They, he doesn't care. He's, he's going in a hook. Yeah, there's no, there's just no doubt he's going to try to control this match inside. I with feel blazing that speed. Evgeny will try to top roll him. That's the best. Work that hand. Here, even if it doesn't pay. If, if even if you can top here. roll him, just keep working that hand. It will also pay out in a hook. But he also has to worry about defense if David is able to crush down on his wrist yeah. and, and get the match inside. He's going to oh, yeah. he's gonna have to defend the hook a little bit before he I feel like switches to the top row. Let's see. Very hard to tell with Prudnik. The setup, his shoulders coming forward. He might go backwards, but he also might just jump in. Like he's kind of carving in, right? But it could be a strategy. We'll see. I feel it's going to be referee's grip. Come on, guys. Rotate. 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 Stop. Okay, yeah, one of those factors, Bray, that you cannot Caution visually available. see is that nervous system, that speed, that explosiveness. And that's, uh, that's what David Dadakon brings to the, the table. Not that Evgeny's that far off. Center here. Oh, definitely. Evgeny Prudnik is They're both super one explosive. of the most well-rounded armisters on the planet, definitely. In uh, in, in there's top, the ten, top ten or five list. Awesome. He's on that list. But today, uh, can he choose the right because options to beat the powerhouse of David here, okay. His cupping abilities, his inside pressure, we saw what he did to, at this point, number one guy Sorry. on the planet with left arm, Artyom Morozov. Mm. Close the decamp first. That's right. David was so impressive against him. Yeah. Nope. First two rounds. One more. Then kind of ran out of gas. First three. Okay. First three. I was right. I was right. And then for, fourth one, he was so close to winning, like maybe two inches off the pad. But when you're so dominant with the hand, hand gets tired. Down, it down. It gets down, tired. Down. Rudnik, don't fight with me. Just down. Go down. Don't move. Go. <laughs> Opa. Very good catch from Evgeny Prudnik. Very good, he's in good defense. Position. This is this will be an inside war, definitely. Prudnik coming in in absolute good shape. Wow. Trying to find the spot that he can moving around. Very good. Wins the first one. 1-0. One I think Evgeny surprised him by putting a lot of breaks yeah. on him. The problem was he was stuck in that position and he was allowing that he can to move around. Yeah. He tried like three or four different options where he would. Where he pinned. We can see 
right here in a replay. He tries to go here. Okay, that's the that pin. Could have been an elbow foul. David was very on the borderline. But yeah, no, very, uh, very surprising to me that David had that that blast in him after after being stopped for that 10, 15 seconds, whatever it was. I think the endurance right here will play a huge factor if I think Rudy can yeah. still stop him. Still in this match. He's in this match. He's, he is in this match. Most people pick David Dadikian as the favorite because of his performances with his left arm. And Prudnik hasn't pulled with his left arm in quite some time. We see that he's worthy and opponent. Again, he's got a little bit of skin taken away from the elbow, so there's, uh, there's definitely been some grinding going on on that elbow pad. I see Neil pick up in a corner saying, let's go, let's go. Uh -huh. For those who just started arm wrestling, they might not realize how much pump you get just from that one grip up. That 10, 15 seconds or even less, it's just so much blood rushing in your forearm. It, it gets very hard, very easy. Tadakan's definitely got a little bit prepared corner with the ice. Okay, we are they both ready. look fresh. We are ready for round number two. Let's see if Prudnik can change some things. What will be better strategies? What do you think would be maybe strap a better plan for Prudnik? He gets I don't know what's going through his head at this moment. If he wants to uh, maybe test the top roll, be, you know, back pressure slip, straps. Uh, I think that would be my, my choice, knowing that David is for sure trying to control the match and, and go inside, why not just kind of, you know, Cobra style top roll and just pull away as, as hard as you can and hope that uh, you can get a little bit of a gap between the, the hands and and make David uh, work a little bit tougher with the, the hand and wrist. Because you know he's going to try to control. Definitely, definitely. He, he doesn't want any straps. He doesn't care about the straps. Okay. I feel that another referee's grip is coming. What it, guys? It was very weird. Right here, when they take the grip, Prudnik is posting. But when they did the referee's grip, Prudnik was low-handing a lot. Referees are allowing boys to work here. Let's see for how long. Yeah, 30 seconds. Ref script. Felt like two hours. As usual, n no emotion shown from either side. Calm, collected here, just with the purpose of winning. Trying to find a way to break their opponent. I definitely think David Dedican expected a much easier match versus Eugeni Prudnik. I definitely know he didn't expect him to stop him at all. Don't move. Go! Ah, in for the Very same. Good. Same positions. Let's see if he can get deeper. Cop gets that pronator down. David transitions to a press. Cannot press him. Moves back, rolls out, rolls out, and top wow. is at the end. Very impressive. David Dadakan, your winner. Strap. I would say get the strap, Eugeni. Strap will help. Maybe maybe he's afraid there was going to be just too much pull from David. But uh, is there no way to get out of David's hand and wrist? Is he that he's very controlling? Good. Yeah. He comes down that hard. Is it the tricep that's doing it, right? The hand is the first of all that's doing the, the things that he's doing. But he's, his ability to switch around, because he was going for a press, then rolls out from the press and goes mm -hmm. for a top roll. Yeah. Right? It's a, yeah, that's a pronation move there for that sure at the end. Definitely, yeah. Very impressive by David 2 0, Dadikan. David Dadikian, one, one pin away from securing this match. Let's see if he has enough endurance and. Prudnik doesn't change something yeah, really no. drastically. Again, he needs to change line. it up, right? He's, he needs to, uh, yeah. like I said, pull maybe, the, pull the thumb out a little hook. bit, stay high, just, yeah, just maybe completely hook commit to a top roll. Yeah, maybe hook in a strap. Maybe that would be the thing that is. 
kind of needed because then it gives less movement options for your opponent. You're stuck, but it gives them more drag. So, Brunic is still in this match. Yeah, let's no, see. Let's see if he can do what he needs to do to get a win. Calm, collected, shows no emotions. Pretty much both guys. Yeah, both these guys are in fantastic shape. Neither one of them are breathing hard. Very little sweat. Mm. Babkin, his corner man. The ice. There's too much water on his floor, on his elbow. That's what Christo just told him. We are ready for round number three. Let's see if there's another referee's grip. David Adikian leads by two to nothing. A lot of sweating. Both the guys are doing a lot of sweating. This time the venue is much more cooler, but still. It is August. It, it is, is August. It's, it's warm in Turkey. It's August in <laughs> Turkey. Yeah. I think I've lost 10 pounds while I've been here. Definitely, yeah. Been just taking showers and <laughs> drinking gallons of water. Не фаланга, немножко, прям. Ну, я на него не наезжаю просто. Both of them are fighting for the high grip, for the knuckle, and again, classic. I feel this the tricep, Ray, that 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 allows David to get that oh, yeah. hook in so well. She has the he, side he's pressure. He's got so much downwards pressure on the on the wrist of his opponent. It's not really controlling the hook with the hand. It's it's that yeah. it's that lat yeah, yeah, yeah. and that, yeah. it's and that not, tricep it's not just that's hand. crashing it's not just down hand. on you. Yeah, yeah. It's supination. It's it's just pressing inside like crazy. All those things together just adds Don't to move the shoulder. power of rotation. Don't move the shoulder. Straight. Rotate. Don't push the center here. Yep, Kenny down. definitely has to change it up. He can't do the same thing three times. We I would love to see a different angle. Okay. Now it looks like Eugeni is still trying to do the same thing. Again, low hand. See how low he is? It's, it's almost like a Babaya move. He, he's, he's setting up like he's going to top roll, but he crashes down so hard on the wrist. Yeah, but you must be down, not covered by knuckle. Yeah, Evgeny can't be fooled by that. He just needs to just, just turn out and get in the straps. Don't move your shoulder. Yeah, this is it. There's no, no way around it. You have to get the strap. You have to do something differently. My pulse, my pulse, no, no, my pulse. Yeah, yeah. is what center, what center, what my ruka was this. Back, okay. Back, back, go back. Uh -huh. Fighting for the center, Don't said Christo. He's pulling back. I need to put my hand a little bit back. Low hand. Down. I feel like Prudnik top roll down. is coming from Evgeny Prudnik. Don't but move. it looks like go. he's gonna get stuck yeah, he's in the still turned in. Oh, yeah, he was, he was turned in. He was turned in. Let's the see. energy's there, though. Goes for the press. <laughs> really hard press from Dali Dodikan. He's in the match. He's in the match. Guts gets his pronator out of the way. Wrist away from the back. the turn around. As soon as David Dadikian re-switches, he uh, has to come up. Is that a elbow foul? Elbow foul for David Dadikian. Uh, elbow foul. What a great match. What a now great match. Now we're in a match. Let's just start talking about just... I he, think this he, might be the, the turnaround. He wasn't committing to a hook. He was committing to a stop, top stop, roll. Stop, stop. He just couldn't get it. He just couldn't get it. The same thing happened with yeah. uh, Artur Morozov. Yeah. Just, just 
it's, 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 it's tough to attack the hand when it's that high on the setup, and then when they say go, it, it just, it just the tricep <laughs> comes crashing down on you yeah. on the wrist. So David's got fantastic technique for that. It's like I said, it reminds me of Rustam Babayev. Knuckles high, crashing down on the wrist. Just impossible to defend against. These guys are the top of the world of arm wrestling for sure. Not, not only in power, but also in strength. Evgeny Prudnik trying to get the crowd. He's got the smile on his face. I think yeah. he's got the confidence. Definitely. Gets the crowd going. So we have one foul. One foul for David Dadikan. Referee is giving a lot of time. Okay. It was way too long for just a foul. What is this? Get those boys on table. Let's get them to arm wrestle. Yeah, I agree. The more time, the more especially favors, if, David. Yeah, especially if you're a more fresher guy. You want the other guy to get tired. Just yeah. get him back. Get him back. And again, again. If you're David Batacon, do you take another foul and possibly just sit it out and rest for the, uh, two minutes? I mean, that might be a that might be another one viable yeah. strategy. But I think he will now just commit 100%. Uh, we will see David one more time facing Garakli. I don't think this is the match he expected at all. And there's there still could be a huge turning point in this match. Referee's grip, one elbow foul, David Dadikian. We see confidence coming back to Evgeny Prudnik. So what's so great about super matches, Ray, right, is, you know, well, you it, can come it, back. it takes away that explosive, you know, out of the blocks monster. And, and, and they, they have to have a little bit of endurance. And someone like Evgeny Prudnik, who's that 880 guy that, that can sprint but also has endurance, yeah. uh, it changes things. You want to be, in super matches, you want to be more complete arm wrestler. You, you want to have technical understanding when the match stops, what to do, and you want to have endurance or conditioning for your arms to being able to not get too pumped. Okay. Let's see. Don't move. Go! Oh, gets it's very deep in the wrist, very deep in the wrist, very close, very close. David Dedekan, but he's getting stretched out. Yep. Getting he's stretched he's out. using that for He's trying no. to move. Shoulder rolling. But very high position from Putin. He's in good position. Defending. Very good, okay, very good, him. very good. Feels like he has it. Oh, and now Prudnik went, but the hand, hand. I feel David that he can, if he wanted, he could top roll him right now. Again, he's definitely putting the pressure on the hand. This oh, is an insane match, and that's that, a victory. That the match? That's that a, a match? victory, yes. Uh, we see the crowd coming alive. We see Evgeny Prudnik coming alive. Two, two, one. This is nowhere near over, Ray. <laughs> no. David Dedekam is having the day he didn't expect he will have. What the absolute warrior tide, Evgeny Prudnik. Tide has turned. Like you said, you don't see a scenario where can someone can just run through Evgeny Prudnik. It's always going to be a battle. He's one of the most complete armistars on the planet. Showed up, as he said, in a really good condition to show himself, get rid of all the injuries, and taking a fight to what some consider number two left hand on the yeah. planet. Evgeny's more of a joint puller. You could see that he's in a much more relaxed. He's committing his frame. He's not. He's not putting the the, the amount of strain that he uh, that David's putting on uh, uh, his uh, on the wrist his, and the hand, hand and arm. Now he tried to slip out, tried to get some I don't even see, know what that was. Was that a, a David's went, attempt to try to yeah. top roll and then he no. just flopped his own wrist back? No. Oh, okay. yeah. It was, no. it was kind of a trying, to, trying just, to king's move without the strap. <laughs> I think he just wanted to get the strap, maybe yeah. change it a yeah. little bit. I feel if David Daddy can right now top roll, so tries to top roll, there's a lane there. We see Prudnik's hand being very... N not easy to open, but possible to open when you are in a deep pit and you roll out. Let's see if he can do it right from the start. It's interesting to know what kind of advice he's getting right here from Bobkin. Uh -huh. Prudnik looking very calm, very collected. 
all throughout the match. Lost first two, didn't phase him. Was in the match. Turned the third one around. And what, this is it. Yeah. What else does David have in his toolbox? Does he have a top roll at all? Can he possibly go outside with Evgeny? He, he said he has a top roll. He just doesn't show it. But, you know, there's there's <laughs> levels to top rolls, if, if right? Kenny, if Kenny's yeah. He's he's fighting Rocking the battle. Get him, get him back up to the yeah. table. He was like, let's go. Let's go. Come on. Maybe continue tomorrow. Yeah, time. Get the clock. Get the clock. Call for the clock, Evgeny. He said maybe continue tomorrow. <laughs> We see, I saw this, the same things in David's eyes on King of the Table 6. Uh, sorry, King of the Table. When, on 6th and 5th round, he was just looking exhausted. He didn't want to be there. That's what happens to those sprinters. Let's see if he has enough zilla, zilla, zilla. power just for the one round. Just for the one zilla, round. Zilla, zilla. If, if you're a sprinter and you're in fantastic shape, you still hate to run that mile. Mm. <laughs> guys putting a lot of chalk on each other's arm. Yes. <laughs> More chalk on the back of his arm. Yeah. Again, that, that was just taking every opportunity. Yeah. You get a little a few more seconds of rest. One warning. One warning for not taking a grip. He just got a warning for just you know delaying the match, let's say, yeah. Avoiding the match. Yeah. Shoulder, straight to shoulder. Grip. Let's go, guys. David Dedican, last time I saw him when he was West, he was pulling left arm versus Oleg Jok. Okay. Mm. Absolutely dominant Can't performance. Control that match. Yeah. This time, different Ukrainian. Magnesium, Not eh? as dominant. Okay, Let's no see. Again, this is taking way too long. Yeah, I don't have a stopwatch uh, yeah. next to me here, Gray, but yeah, this next definitely time. seems to be a little bit longer than two minutes. Yeah. Yeah. Referee's group straight away. Yeah, we see David is an absolutely sprinter. He's getting so exhausted. You can hear the breathing. Mm. Yeah. Two rounds back, that was Prudnik that was breathing a little heavy. But now, let's see if Prudnik has enough power to top roll him or still gonna end up in a hook. No, 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 no. Oh. Come on, please. David is pulling every trick. Every trick. <laughs> every trick. Out of the book to, yeah. to prolong this match, to get some rest. I was, I was, I was holding my down, breath down. for it. I was like, <laughs> come on. Down. Okay. Straight. Don't move. Go. Oh. Finally. First There's the top. There's the top roll. We see the top roll from David Dadakan. Yeah. Yeah, I think this is an opportunity to possibly even rest. Even if the top roll isn't successful, no. at least it's not going to take a bunch of wear and tear on him. Maybe it gives him another two minutes to collect himself, get that yeah. good blood back in his arm. And uh, and go as hard to, as he can to just to finish this. Yeah. Like, all he needs to do is finish this match, yeah, he's this round, and he wins the match. Yeah. Well, this round or the next. I mean, there, there may be a little chess play in this. Hey, stop. If I'm still feeling a little numb, if I'm David Dadakan, I might not throw this match, but definitely just go in a weird direction where I can actually, you know, sit down for another couple of minutes and maybe, maybe collect try myself. The top roll. Maybe try the yeah, top no, of roll. course he's gonna. Right. I think he's trying to get a try for the top roll. Yeah. I'm interested to see what Pruning did. Like his success was in the hook, but it also wasn't right. First two rounds he just couldn't, and it's very always very dangerous how local your your opponent gets your arm close to the pad, but it's hard to top roll, okay, but again. Don't move your shoulder, don't move your shoulder. Center, center, center. Okay, he's got the good side of the strap, and his boy, it's low. Same if if, yeah? if Genny was ever going to try to top roll, this would oh. be the point. Oh, it's like one inch lower than others. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're really positioning Evgeny low, though. Boy, oh, that's inside, like that's going to be inside, that's going to be inside, hook. 
Don't move. Go. Oh wow. Definitely the referees so. just set him in. Very the good. Very good. Very good. Yeah, Evgeny doesn't. He, just to be patient now. He's he's in the driver's seat. Good block by Dadikian. The problem is he doesn't, in my opinion, endurance just to sit there and you know no, wait no, him out. No, he can't wait him no. out. No, this it's going to be the opposite. This is Evgeny's yeah. to win. As he hits, he opens himself a little uh, more. Elbow, elbow foul. foul. Elbow foul. Not that a bad was, idea. That was get the restart. Yeah. But I, I feel David is running out of options. Yeah, no, he has to, he has to go. He has gone. to go all in on the start. He he can't be he can't be. And he, can, he into cannot the, even the, engage the side pressure yeah. fully because the cupping of. He needs he needs the time to go. He needs to be explosive. He needs to put all his chips on the table at the go. This the longer this thing goes, uh, the more of Guinea is in the in the driver's seat. I think he senses it too, Ray. <laughs> Prudnik's strategy works. You should just, I think it's, you can always get stretched out when you try to top roll, so better just stick to the hook, especially in the strap. Make this 2-2. And for first time on this card, we're going to go to the fifth round if this is successful. But right now, David Dedikian is still in the match. He's looking very tired. Breathing hard and heavy. Starting your your east versus west, and you have two matches, and one was brutal. It's usually I, I I haven't seen much guys who who have done really like tough match on the first and then done well on mm -hmm. the second. Mm -hmm. Such a such a difference between super match format like this versus open tournament. Yeah. The open tournament, David. It, would get a Just chance to be able through. to sit down and yeah. you know collect himself, yeah. and rest 10, 15, 20 minutes, half hour yeah. later, get called up for that second, third match. Yeah. <laughs> Different outcome completely. Let's go, open. Good. Up and down. Open. One level, one level. Prudnik, don't go so high. Put the arms on the one level. As I'll, I'll, I'll say my opinion. Is it Michael Todd? Is Michael Todd in the room? <laughs> he's somewhere, he's somewhere there. Don't pull, don't pull. But uh, I think don't that uh, it's okay, don't in, in this case, right, David is intentionally trying to delay the match. Yeah, of course. It's, it's not good for the viewers, for everyone. It's not good for his opponent. But he's, he's doing everything in, yeah. his, in his... In my opinion, if referees would fold him out, it's ability. absolutely understandable. Like I said, Ray, it might be too late now, but... Okay. Good. Yes. Referee's grip. Open. Put your arm down. Straight your shoulder, don't move your shoulders. The same way, yeah? It's the Prudnik first. Okay. Round number four, one elbow foul for David Dadikian. Rotate. Uh, we're gonna Rotate. see an inside war, don't definitely. Move. More initiation from Prudnik. He just falls into that defensive position, boy. Gets good, rotates almost. He's waiting for David to attack. As David attacks, he stretches himself out. There's more. Yeah, he's top row he's option. Towards the hand. Towards the hand. Gets the top row. Gets the press. Wow. Look at that turn. 2 2. We are done. in for round number Beautifully five. Beautifully done. Evgeny Prudnik. That impressive armor, sir. Really impressive armor, sir. One of the top guys, if you want to see like some mastery of armor sling, he's. At this stage of this age of arm wrestling, he's the one of the guys to look forward to. Ability to move between techniques, fighting in different styles, endurance, strength, everything is there. Understanding on table. He knew exactly what Dadikan was doing and was working him every single round. Just found a lane and just worked. So close for David Dadikan for to, to do this 3 0, but so close. What is Arakli thinking right now? 
Oh, he's, he's celebrating. <laughs> is, he, is he he's, celebrating in the back a, room? He's back in his room <laughs> drinking <laughs> champagne <laughs> already. <laughs> I, I think this is brutal, just looking at David, right? Yeah. Everything about his body language, uh, how he acts, everything says that he is tired and it's going to be very, very long night for him. So right now, in my opinion, the pendulum has swung and it is Evgeny Prudnik. Yeah, no, he, he, he can sense it. It will be very hard for David to change this match right now. Prudnik, like, he's already ready. He's like, let's go, let's just go. And in David's mind, it's so hard because you, you've been so close to victory, so close to victory, so close to ending this match. David's in great shape, too. I mean, he, I'm, I'm sure he pulls for hours with yeah. the, uh, the Plinkoff group. Yeah. So he's no stranger I think to, the, the to pulling tough thing for hours. Is, the tough thing is when things go not according to plan, yeah. not according to no. plan. Right? It's, it's different. It's different to practice for hours and then be on a time clock of 90 seconds or two minutes between hard matches like this. Speaking Russian, though? Yeah. I'm, I'm trying to listen to. He said, you think I'm going to cry? I'm not going to cry. You're, you're going to you're gonna eat your words. Pretty much like that. They're still trash talking each other. Oh, yeah. Shoulder? Balabul. I feel like, not like real, but little threats on the table. <laughs> <laughs> Just trying to make make this go a different shoulder. round, make this shoulder go back. a little different way. Shoulder. 100% shoulder. committing to inside both shoulder. of these guys. Mm. Maybe, Rotate. maybe Rotate. even not the referee's mm. correct. Right? No, I think the referees are happy to even just Rotate. let it go yeah. right there. I yeah. mean, yeah. we, we see both it in the previous round. Yeah. 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 Both no, guys, I mean, both, well, both okay, guys are in agreement, you just let it go. Yeah, the referee's great. Don't make it any harder. Round number five, two, two. First two, David Dadikan. Third and fourth, Evgeny Prudnik just showing the mastery of arm wrestling, taking control of this match. David's still fighting. He's got some fight left in him. Prudnik is not playing any games. Very calm, collective. Yeah. No, Evgeny can definitely cannot let down. Neither one of these guys can let down. It's not a sure thing for either one of them. Rotate. Rotate. Straight. Round number five. Go! Inside a hook. Good wow. position from Gany Prudnik. Just surges, press. When it goes through press, goes to inside. Tests a hand, gets the top roll. David Dadikan is either going to get wow. pressed and gets pressed. Wow. wow. What a performance. Wow. Congratulations, Gany Prudnik. Boy, this match was just pure power from the beginning to the end. Side pressure, inside hook ability. David Dadakan showing his ability to, to be explosive and to have the power off the, off the uh, beginning early matches. But uh, congratulations of Genny Prudnik to, to sticking it out and making this race a little longer, um, bringing it into a, a deeper water. And um, wow. David Dadakan, nothing to be ashamed of. Uh, fighting until the end, doing everything he could possibly do. Evgeny Prudnik sticking, sticking to what he knew. Got the endurance game going. And prevailed. Final round, stayed, stayed hooked, stayed true to the belief. Evgeny Prudnik, congratulations. This, this. If 
Evgeny Prudnik with the final nail in the coffin, the press. Couldn't finish him with the top row, which is surprising. Congratulations, both men. I am here with the winner, Evgeny Prudnik. What a match! Are you not entertained? Starting this match from behind, testing the power of Daddy Daddy Kian, losing first two rounds, but you still found a way to beat him. How do you feel? How do you feel about this match? Uh, thank you who support me. Uh, anyone believe in me, but I did it and I'm happy. And thank you who support. We. I would love to see you more with left arm. Do you have someone you want to fight on left arm? Um, I don't know. Uh, now uh, I can pull, I can won, uh, I can beat the Dikan and uh, uh, who, who pull with him? Uh, Artyom Morozov. Uh, okay, I am, I am here. I am ready. Come on. Come on, guys, who won? Who, who won? Yogi Prudnik, probably the match of night till now.